one shot at our cruiser, and it's disabled at this time. An intense manhunt for a gunman that shot at a Millis police officer inside his cruiser coming to an end, but not with the capture of a suspect. We have determined that the officer's story was fabricated. No idea why it was done or why he did it. Bruce Michelli says that officer, who is now terminated from the department, grew up with his children. Millis police have not released the officer's name pending formal charges and will only say he's a part-time officer. But sources say he's Brian Johnson of Millis. Nervous and anxious. Michelli says that's how Johnson seemed Wednesday when he stopped by his house to talk about what had happened. I guess he usually stops and asks somebody on the side if they need help. I was going to ask him if they needed help, and all of a sudden he said he had two shots coming through his windshield. Wow. And you believed him? Yeah, I mean, yeah, not, no reason not to. He says Johnson felt scared for his life. I said, the news said you fired two shots at him, and he said, he said, yeah, he did. He says, you never know, he tried to kill me, he's going. That's how, that's how he felt. I like the kid, you know, just nice, like I said, a very nice family. Other neighbors say Johnson lives at this home with his parents and that they're nothing but nice. We've lived here for 19 years and it's just a really, really, really nice family. They're fabulous people. They've been wonderful neighbors and I think um, people jump to conclusions very quickly. Police won't say if Johnson admitted to the alleged plot, but say ballistics evidence from Forest Road shows the shots weren't ever fired by a suspect and that there was never a gunman around town. Johnson allegedly claimed after he was shot at, he crashed his cruiser and then it caught fire. Police won't say whether or not Johnson torched his own cruiser and say that is part of the investigation. And no word at this point as to where Johnson is. He is not in custody at this point, and Millis police are not commenting on a motive for all of this, nor his prior job performance. Reporting from Millis, Massachusetts, I'm Katherine Sotnik, NECN.